Harley. So are you aware of Harley Davidson's India uh, operations? No, I wasn't aware that they were in India. Yeah, so Har- I'm, I'm guessing they're making a very different motorcycle. No. So Harley Davidson moved to India, or didn't move, but built a has attempted to build a very high operations in India because India is the number one country in the world for buying motorcycles. Yep, that makes sense. Yes. Okay. They're everywhere. They that's, that's huge population that's density. Normal, normal. Yeah. Transportation. The problem is the Indian motorcycle in U.S. dollars is usually on average, I forget the exact number, we'll say $2,000 is like a high end. The the low end, like middle middle model that's the most sold is like $1,000 or $1,500. That'd be about right. right. Yeah. Harley Davidson's is like seven grand minimum over there. Yeah. It's, It's the motorcycle for the rich. Well, so get this. It used to not be that way. Okay. It used to be they were struggling. Okay. What happened is due to all the American business influx in India, it's built a middle-class Indian society. Oh, okay. And so now the middle-class Indian society's sign of success is driving a Harley Davidson. (laughs) (laughs) Um, There's an interesting video done a couple years ago by CNBC talking about that, and I thought it was really interesting. How Harley is the Cadillac of... (laughs) motorcycles in India. India. (laughs) I thought that was absolutely hilarious. But I think it says a lot about, A, how market demand can change, right? Because it used to be that that market didn't exist. There was not people willing. They wanted a a Harley Davidson, but, like, the financials weren't there to afford one. Right. Well, when you understand that for years you could buy a very large, very nice house, um, all custom tile work everywhere, Okay, for like forty three thousand dollars to sell a four seven thousand five hundred dollar motorcycle in yeah. that environment, there's just not a lot of bodies. Yeah, there's just not a lot of people. No, and, and but I I mean I just think that transition of demand, right, is is huge. Number one, number two, it also was a struggling division of Harley Davidson for a while, and it still is a struggling division because. They're still sitting there looking at every like all these other manufacturers that are making tons of money in India, and they're sitting there like just trying to sell <laughs> these high end right motorcycles, and just people don't have the money for it. Right. Well, the, the other people that are making tons 